How's it going guys? It's me, the gaming pig, back with another video. Now, let's get rid of the elephant in the room. That is, I'm doing a face cam video for the first time in a while. Um, I don't know, I feel like voiceover videos were working for that. I wanna try face camera videos and see if you guys like that. Comment which one you like, do a little poll in the comment section. I wanna hear what you guys have to think. Do you think voiceover videos work more for news, or do you think that face cam videos work really like just fine? I love to hear your thoughts in the comments because I just want to hear what you guys have to think, and I'll do whatever you guys think is better. So I have a lot of news for Five Nights at Freddy's Help Wanted. So I'm not gonna waste any time, but I'm gonna be talking about some extra news that we've gotten for the game. So, to all you PC users that were worried that it would only be on PSVR, it's not. It's also going to be on HTC Vive and Oculus Rift. So if you have one of those, if you have a PC and you bought one of those, you're fine, you're fine. You don't need to worry about going out to buy a PS4 and then to buy a PSVR. You're fine. That's literally all you need if you already have it, is your PC and your HTC Vive or your Oculus. Oculus is probably more popular, but HTC Vive is also really popular. So, posted on the PS4 website is that you will be able to earn collectibles in this game. So, co the collectibles being plushies, bobbleheads, and action figures, and much, much more, I'm sure. Um, and then you can go to the prize corner and you can uh, actually play with these um, figures in VR. So I'm assuming we're playing with it means like you can like move it around, you know, like the spring shop. Maybe you're in the spring shop toy. You got to move it around, you get to play with it in VR. So it's kind of like playing with a toy in real life, but you're in VR. I think that's a pretty good idea. I think that gives it replayability um, because if you see a YouTuber that found, say, like, a, a plush for, like, Fredbear in the FNAF 4 house, then you can go and play that game, or F the FNAF 4 game again, and you can hopefully find that plush from where the YouTuber found it, and you'll be replaying the game. So, you, it will not really get that old very quickly. Um, you'll have a lot to work for. So, I think that's really good news. Um, I think... That, that just sounds fun. This game is sounding more and more fun. Um, and they're really scary. I'm really scared <laughs> for it. Um, and all the jump scares. Because I've never done a VR jump scares. So it's going to be scary. Um, then we have this uh, Steel Wool actually uh, tweeted the same teaser image that Scott has on Scott Games. Except... Um, Nightmare Young is replaced with Spring Bonnie in this image. So as you can see here, um, it's it's in Spring Bonnie. It's not a fan-made Spring Bonnie one. It's basically Springtrap, but unwithered. So I think that is really cool. Um, one grab I have, and it's little, but it's there. It's obvious. His uh, Springtrap is supposed to have top teeth, and in this image. Spring Bonnie does not have top teeth. So, I don't know if, like, I don't know. It's supposed to have top teeth. Don't know why it doesn't. Well, we'll find out, I guess. But that does also confirm that we are getting Spring Bonnie in this game. So, that's really cool. Um, and it's not a fan made model, which is always a plus. Uh, next um, up is that Metacritic gave this game a release date of April 2019, so take this release date with a grain of salt, but it's possible. Um, so next up, and the last thing, is that people were kind of angry that that Nightmare Fredbear was brown. That's actually confirmed by Scott, um, that it was in an early build, so Nightmare Fredbear did not have his actual skin yet, so they just made him brown to see if he worked. So in the game, he will be yellow and golden, and it will be, it will be good. It will be, you know, it will look like the actual game. It's just the trailer was made for an early build, so it looks weird and different than it should. 
But that's literally all the news I have, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment what you think, and if you haven't already, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video of mine. See you guys in the next video. Bye.